Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at the shock strap, 15 foot long ratchet tie down strap with the shock absorber. It's for a quantity of one strap. Now this shock absorbing ratcheting tie down strap will let you secure cargo in your truck better, your trailer. And I want to zoom in on the unique feature of this strap, which is this built-in urethane shock absorber. It's designed to help absorb any impact to ensure constant tension of the strap, even as your load shifts. This shock absorber right here is made of a urethane-based material, and it'll stand up to extreme temperatures, to salt water, moisture, oil, and most chemicals. And if you notice, they attach it to the strap by using the sturdy grade eight bolts and the nylock nuts, which will hold the shock in place. Also, if you notice on the side right here, it has a safety strap, and that safety strap was on there for two purposes. The first one is to give you an extra strap if for some reason the shock absorber would break. Now, the shock absorber would probably never break, but just for safety reasons, they do put this extra strap on there. The manufacturer does say that this uh, shock absorber would have to be stretched 18 to 20 inches for it to even think about breaking, and you'll notice when you use it and tighten it down that this will usually never even stretch hardly anything. But the other reason for the safety strap, the second reason is to act like a limiter so that you don't over ratchet the strap. So basically what you do is when you hook up your strap and start tightening it down, as it tightens up, you'll want the, this strap here will get closer to the shock absorber and you'll want to use it as a guideline because you want to be able to slide your fingers on your hand between the safety strap and the shock absorber for correct tension. So you'll be able to slide it in and slide it out. So as you tighten it down and it starts to stretch and get tighter, this will give you a good guideline of how tight you want it to be. Now this strap is DOT approved, Department of Transportation, and also made in the USA. And also because of the shock absorber feature, this strap is great for securing cargo that has a suspension system that can compress and rebound when you travel rough terrain. So this strap is great for tying down snowmobiles, motorcycles, utility tractors, even ATVs and UTVs. Because what'll happen with those is because they have a suspension system that'll give. If you go over any rough surfaces and it's strapped down and yet suspension gives, it could loosen the straps. But with this straps, what's nice is this shock absorber will keep that tension so you don't run into that problem. The ratchet mechanism right here you can see makes it very easy to tighten down the strap and maintain tension on the strap. You can see as you crank it and ratchet it, it'll pull the strap in to tighten it. In the very middle right here, you can see, has a nice release lever. And this handle is nice and large because even if you're wearing thick, heavy gloves, you can still use it, your gloves with your gloves on to operate the handle. Wanted to zoom out and just show you what we're talking about. So to ratchet it, just like that, you can see it's pulling in this strap here. And the other nice feature is if you're going to go hook up and you need to pull out some extra uh, strap to attach it, what you can do is pull up on that release lever, release the handle, and go all the way the other way and push it until it locks into place. And then that releases the handle from the ratchet mechanism and it'll allow that strap to freewheel so you can pull out as much as you need. So if you have a distance to go, it makes it quick and easy just to pull out what you need. Once you're there, hook it up and then just pull the lever, put your ratchet back, or the handle back in the ratchet, and just like that, you're ready to crank it in. Very simple to operate, very simple to hook up. Now on each end, they have these S-hooks. We'll zoom in and show you the S-hooks you can see here. These S-hooks have a nice wide one-inch opening, so when you push down the retention clip, it gives you a nice one-inch opening allows a nice hassle-free connection to any anchor points. And if you notice on the hook itself, it has a nice rubber coating on it, which will protect your gear, your truck, or your trailer that you hook it to. The retention clips, again, they keep the hooks connected to your anchor points. And also on each end, you'll notice they have these straps with the loop on it. These are integrated soft loops so that you can wrap it around an axle or a handlebar and then pull it tight up against the hook. In case your hook won't be able to reach something, you can just use this bring it back by and hook up, makes it a lot easier. <clears throat> now all the steel parts on this strap have a nice corrosion resistant yellow zinc chromate coating. Holds up to any hot, cold, or wet weather conditions. And the webbing on this is a nice durable black polyester webbing. And it is UV resistant, will withstand abrasions and even, even water absorption. The dimension on the strap is one and a half inches wide. This one is 15 feet in length. Now they do also offer a shorter length, which is seven feet. We do sell that separately. It's on our website. It's part number SS58MV. 
Now the minimum usable length, in other words, the shortest you'd be able to use this at is 29 inches. Now they do have a list, a strap on here and it'll list the maximum load or braking strength, which will be 3,000 pounds. And they also list the safe working load limit, which is a third of that, so it'd be 1,000 pounds. Now on tie down straps, they must be chosen according to their safe working load limit. So the weight of the secured cargo must not exceed the combined working load limit of the straps being used. So for a good example, if you're using these straps with a working load limit, let's say of 500 pounds each, to tie down a load that weighs 1,000 pounds, then you just need to use two straps to safely secure that load. And I do always like to recommend that you always use straps in pairs. But that should do it for the review on the shock strap, 15 foot long ratchet tie-down strap with the shock absorber for a quantity of one strap.